Welcome back, it's me Lou. I'm here for another action figure unboxing and review, and today from Fisher Price from the League of Super Pets animated feature, we are featuring uh, Superman and Crypto, a boy and his dog. All right, so uh, the animated feature came out, I think like, was it almost two years ago? Um, and uh, recently I reviewed the McFarlane um, Superman and Crypto action figure. And it kind of sent me down this rabbit hole of trying to hunt down other cryptos. Uh, just because um, some, of the do some of the DC super pets kind of do fascinate me. Uh, of course, like Crypto and Duke the Bat Hound are probably the two most um, notable DC super pets. Uh, but I also kind of like some of the weird obscure ones uh, like Damian Wayne's uh, Bat Cow and the Red Lantern uh, Dexter, uh, the cat. Uh, but I, th I, I, knew, I remember seeing this at stores, and um, I kind of wanted to purchase it at the time, but, you know, that ship kind of, like, <laughs> sailed away. So I had to kind of hunt this down on the secondary market, and I got this for a, a re very reasonable price on Amazon. I think I actually got it for below uh, retail, so that was nice. Um, I do have a couple of the oddball, uh, like, Play School and Fisher Price superhero figures in my collection, um, so I thought, you know, this Superman would be very much at home, um, uh, you know, with my handful of like Supermans and Batmans they are kind of more aesthetically designed for kids as opposed to like, you know, adult collectors. Uh, the crypto just looks fun. You know, it's a very cartoon, uh, style, uh, you know, action figure. And again, this, I could easily, I could easily pair this up with any of the other Supermen in my collection. On the back, uh, that features punching action, as you can see right there. And then here's the team lineup from the animated feature, if you remember, you know, this <laughs> cuddly group of friends. And then there's also uh, Batman and then the Wonder Woman. So yeah, let's check this out. You know, this is, a, my expectations, I don't want to say they're low, um, because that kind of infers that, you know, I... You know, I might have some negative thoughts about this, but I think for the most part, you know, I, I kind of know what I'm getting into. You know, this is much more of a a child's toy than an adult collectible. So I kind of know what to expect. And I got to <laughs> I gotta find a way to cut these ties off. These ties are kind of stubborn. Um, all right, there's the crypto. Let's get Superman out. And then let's, uh, let's not forget the little accessory here. This almost looks like I want. I think this is uh, I think red kryptonite, if I remember correctly. It's a nice hollow piece, you know, clear red plastic. You know, it can e e easily set it down as a prop. And let's take a look uh, at, the at the figures themselves. Uh, let's start with Superman first. We'll save for crypto for last. Uh, the Superman's nice. Uh, the expression, you know, this is based off of the animated feature, so of course it's going to look uh, a little bit more on the cartoony side. Um, it almost kind of resembles in some ways, uh, you know, like Buzz Lightyear in terms of the aesthetic or the dad from The Incredibles. Uh, the paint application is really clean on the eyes. Uh, the colors, the iris, the pupil, everything is just really well done. Same with the eyebrows. He has Superman's trademark spit curl uh, coming off the top of his head. You cast him under the right light and the shadows on him just look really, really clean. 
a uh, very well presented figure. Uh, the emblem it, it's kind of reminiscent of the OG Superman logo and also the logo from Kingdom Come. It looks like he has the newer design, New 52 style of belt. Uh, yellow cuffs on his sleeve, which is kind of interesting uh, for design choice. And he does not have the emblem on the back. And you can see some of the ink from the, either the package is kind of like stained onto the cape. And he has like, some fuzz on his... Uh, articulation, his head, very simple. Keep in mind, this is a child's toy, so it's not like it's going to be super poseable. You have some articulation in the wrists. Legs kick up. And that's essentially it. You know, it's a decent Superman figure. Uh, Size-wise, I think he might fall in maybe at five and a half, five and three quarters. Well, here he is next to a Marvel Legends 6-inch scale Darwin, 7-inch uh, scale McFarlane Batman, 7-inch scale Diamond Select Alfred. So, And also here's the older Mattel Movie Masters. So that, that, there's where he kind of falls in in terms of the height lineup. And let's get to, uh, which I believe is the main event, let's get to Crypto. Um, I love the crypto character, you know, whether it's from the comic books or in any of the various forms of animation. Uh, it's Clark's uh, faithful uh, Kryptonian sidekick. And great, beautiful expression. Uh, it looks like the animation model, you know, kind of like come to life. Uh, the cape, much like Superman, is a very soft plastic. Uh, it's kind of cool that he has this the emblem on the back of his cape, unlike Superman here. Um, he does also have um, the collar with the Superman S on the, on the dog tag. Again, much like Superman, very clean application of paint on the eyes. Yeah, so it's a nice figure. Um, his legs move, so you can get him in you know, flying poses. It'd be nice if his if his paws could move forward, but they can't. And then his head could move also. So yeah, great pair. Um, if you could find this for a reasonable price, I think it's worth it. Uh, just for the crypto. And uh, the Superman's decent also. If you have any of the like older uh, Fisher Price, Play School, or even the Justice League figures uh, from the animated series from years ago that are kind of done in the cartoon aesthetic. I think this would feel very much at home with those. It's pretty cool. I dig it a lot. All right, so with that being said, let's wrap this one up. Uh, once again, my name is Lou. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you are a returning viewer or subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. I greatly appreciate it. So until the next video, be safe, take care of yourself, buy lots of toys, and most importantly, be happy. And I'll see you at the next one. All right, later.